Welcome to this Ask an Expert video where we share questions submitted to our charting experts. The topic for this video is using template colors in your MECO graphics charts. Here's a question submitted by a user. Is there a way to import colors from a PowerPoint template to MECO graphics? The answer is yes, so let me show you how you can do that. If you open a new presentation in PowerPoint, you can choose which theme you want to use for the presentation. So I'm going to choose this organic theme. And then to use the theme colors from this presentation in my Meco Graphics charts, I'm going to click on Meco Graphics and open the Preference Manager. To create a color palette, from this theme, I'll click on New, and under Add Colors from File, I'll choose the file name for my theme. You can navigate to where your themes are. I'll choose Organic. And you can see now I have the colors from the theme. I have primarily six colors here, accent one through six. If you have complicated charts or you want to do more monochromatic coloring on your charts, you can add more shades for each of these colors. To do that, under Add Colors from File, choose the third option, which is from a PowerPoint or theme file with extra shades. Choose Organic again. I have the same accent colors, but then if I scroll down, you can see I have shades for each one of the accent colors. The next step is to select how you'd like these colors to appear in your Meco Graphics charts. We call that setting the draw order. So if you want to select these six colors, I'm holding down the shift key, and then clicking the right arrow, you can see that's what a bar would look like in your chart. You can also move colors around. So if I like this blue color, I can move it to the second position instead of the third position by just clicking the up and down arrows. And now I need to do the same thing for the draw order for lines. And if I click on the colors tab, you can see I have the option to set the color for just about everything on the chart from the grid lines to quadrant lines to axis lines and I can choose any color available in this palette. So now that I've selected my draw orders I can save this palette and I'm going to call it organic and now you'll see that that's shown as a custom palette and I need to determine whether I want it to appear in the color drop downs for my charts. In this case I do. And I can decide whether I want it to be the default palette that I use in Meco Graphics or not. Now if I go back to my presentation with this organic template, I can add a Meco Graphics chart. And you can see that it's colored according to my palette. One other thing I wanted to show you here is what happens when you bring in a chart that was created in a different color palette. So this is a cluster bar chart from our Chart of the Week series. I'll copy that, paste it into our new presentation using the organic template. First thing I'll do is I'll resize that so it fits. To apply the colors to this chart, under Color, I'll choose Reset Colors. That just clears any custom colors and any draw order changes from the previous color palette. And then I'll choose the palette I want to use. In this case, it's called Organic. If you're a consultant who works with many clients, you can create a custom palette for each client simply by using the colors from a client PowerPoint presentation. You can also share your palettes by going to Preference Manager. I can choose this organic palette 
and that will include the colors and the draw orders. And I can save it to an XML file to share with other members of my team. And they can import the colors just like we did from the theme from this drop down menu. Thank you for watching this Ask an Expert video from Mechographics.